I was born in Israel. Uh, my parents are survivors of Holocaust. My mother's from Romania, my father is from Poland, and my father came here first. He was waiting for everybody, and uh, I was really, really happy to be here. The Holocaust exhibit was inspired by my parents, what they've been through, their courage, their hope, their determination, that they were able to survive what they did. It's a very difficult exhibit to do because it's highly emotional and uh, the people that come here, my guests, my visitors, are touched by it and there's so much sadness in it and I almost have to look to the other side to the joy that they have survived and that we have a better life as a result of that. Which brings me to the other side of the uh, Americans and the Allied forces, how they saved our country, how they saved the world. I'm, I love this country very much and it's in that gratitude that I do politics, freedom, and the underdog. My husband is very supportive of what I do. When I met him, he had a uniform on. He's a disabled American veteran. And this is the ninth uh, installation of politics, freedom, and the underdog. My husband and I, we had a uh, restaurant in Brooklyn, and it was sort of like the little core of a community. And every day it would be the same people that would stop by. And one day, I was wrapping up a sandwich or something, and I don't know, the, something with the paper bag, it was crumpled. And uh, as I'm giving back um, the order, I'm looking at it and I'm seeing a face. <laughs> it was very whimsical, it was very funny. And I'm thinking, I don't know where this comes from, maybe because I'm seeing all these people, all these faces, all this interaction. And that was the beginning of the Zeke. I used to have a lot of furniture here. <laughs> and slowly each piece, not important, not important, get rid of it. And I never replaced the furniture, so it was replaced by different works of art. Uh, I would put them outside for various uh, different things, for elections. I guess it was sort of like art in public spaces, except that this was my space, like I've done all along. My personal vision uh, that comes out in the work comes from what I have experienced in my life. It comes from who I am, but what drives me is my spirit, and that's what's in my work.